Hello friends, I am Dr. Rohit Batra from Derma World Skin and Hair Clinics and today we are going to talk about molluscum contagiosum. Yes, many a times people come to me with uh, tiny little bumps on their face or uh, on genitals or any other body part and they are glistening white with a tiny uh, central umbilication that we call is that there is a central depression in that. You can see here what exactly a molluscum looks like and they feel that they are suffering from any skin allergy or they are suffering from a sort of acne or pimples but no molluscum contagiosum is a viral infection which is as the name itself calls is contagious that is it can spread from one to another usually in the childhood when it happens on a children's face or body parts it occurs from one to another while they are playing together in schools when uh, it occurs on body parts of uh, females or males when they go to salon spa etc and genital molluscum which are uh, at, at times can be a florid representation that there are many molluscum occurring in the genital area it can be because of sexual exposure also so depending upon the site a dermatologist comes to know that what sort of molluscum contagiosum you are suffering from and uh, usually what would have been uh, the root of the tra transferring of the infection in your body and in case it is on face or any other exposed body part uh, then they just remove it but yes in case it's genital molluscum contagiosum then your dermatologist will definitely get few tests done also so that it's not only this viral infection that has been uh, passed on to you from your partner but it can be at times few other infections also that might could have been transferred which don't show on skin but yes we should get few tests done also now coming on to the treatment as to what exactly we can do yes we have to remove there can be various uh, procedures that can be done to remove in children we try to remove it with topical application of retinoic acid etc though the chances of getting uh, removed are say around 50 to 60 percent only but because in children we don't want to do any procedure we try to uh, do that at times 10 percent koh is something that your dermatologist will get made for you and you can try it but the short short treatment to get molluscum remove it that we have to remove it it can be chemical cautery that we are burning it with tc etc or a radio cautery that we are burning it through electricity and heat or it might be scooping out that is molluscum removal that your uh, dermatologist will remove the molluscum region wherever they are there might be tiny lead, uh, red bleeders that might occur if you are re removing it and you have a uh, big uh, molluscum in a couple of days everything is fine so if you're suffering from molluscum make sure you visit your dermatologist get an investigation done in case it is needed and get them removed there is a slight chance that the molluscum might reappear because your dermatologist is going to uh, treat or remove the lesions which are visible to you and him or her but in case new lesions do develop in say a couple of weeks or months get them removed also because even if one lesion are there new lesions might be formed in the same or the different area so if you like the video do subscribe to our channel that's derma world skin and hair clinics and we'll be here to share various other videos for, for skin hair and aesthetic needs of you Thank you. Stay blessed.